This is an NBC Connecticut Kids Connection digital exclusive. Proudly brought to you by ACES. Hi everybody, Kids Connection Kids. This is Mike Heideck with my daughter Molly. We're here with another art project this week and we have some canvas and a bunch of other supplies. Molly, what are we doing? We're making crayon art. Pretty cool, huh? I did this at a summer camp I went to last year. You need a hot glue gun. You need some crayons. We also need canvas because you put the crayons on it. And you have a heat gun. But since my dad said not a lot of people have heat guns, hair dryer works too. Because that's actually what I did to make this at my summer camp. Cool. All right, so first step is, what do I do and what do you do? So the first thing we do is we have to attach the crayons to the canvas. And there's two ways you can do this. The way I did it, I did a circle pattern where I would have all of the colors just mixing and it's kind of abstract. Yep. But the way I think we're gonna do it now is we're gonna do a waterfall pattern where we attach the crayons in one row at the top and then the heat gun will go down and then it'll dribble down like a waterfall. Okay, cool. All right, let's get started. All right, and you just grab the, the color crayon you want and you stick it right to the canvas. Do you have to press it or what do you have to do? You usually press it just to make sure it doesn't fall off. That happened to me with some of the crayons on there. Okay, well, it looks like these crayons are just about stuck, Molly. So that means, look, we can hold it up and they won't fall. So what's the next step? Next step is to use the heat gun you or hair dryer, because again, that's what I use to make mine, but my dad got a heat gun. So let's okay. do this. We're gonna start on low so my dad doesn't get burned. Yep, go ahead. All right, white's melting and the purple's melting at this moment. Oh, this is really cool. Ow! No, just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> and the good thing is, whatever color you like most, you can heat up more, so it'll add more of your favorite color to the middle. Look at how the pink is running right through the center. I think it's just about good. So there you have it, right? Super easy. All you do is hot glue the crayons to a piece of canvas and then you... You take your hair dryer or heat gun. Uh, just to know, heat gun is going to be way faster because hair dryer, you've got to put it on the highest level if you want it to go fast. But we use this. And also, you should let it sit for a couple of minutes because, you know, hot wax is not very safe. Right. All right, that'll do it for this week's Kid Connection Art Project. We'll see you guys next time. I'm Mike Heideck. This is Molly Heideck. Take care, everybody. Kids, I'm Ceci del Carmen from Telemundo, Connecticut, and I'm going to teach you some Spanish words on Kids Connection. The Spanish word for today is perro, which means dog. Can you say it with me? Perro. Very good. Until next time, adios. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now. Here at Kids Connection, we love to see your pictures and videos. Here are our friends, Jacqueline and Josephine. Isn't their hand art beautiful? Great job, girls. After watching Kids Connection, Easton learned how to make pigs in a blanket. Don't they look delicious? And what do you want to be when you grow up? Ella shared her plans with us. Hi, I'm Ella. When I grow up, I want to be, I want to work for NASA or be a comedian. We know you'll be a great success, Ella. If you'd like to be featured on Kids Connection, have an adult send a video or photo to share it at NBCConnecticut.com. Thank you for watching this NBC Connecticut Kids Connection digital exclusive. Make sure to come back each week for all new videos. Proudly brought to you by ACES.